Good morning. This is Greg Rice with a Bear Star Homes on Friday, the 5th of October. And I'm out at Clark's Crossing with your production update this morning. Uh, in front of you, lot number seven. Um, due to have a pre construction meeting with lot number seven, but we decided to uh, go ahead and get the foundation started prior to that because it looks like a very safe thing to do. Uh, as you can see, the uh, crew is setting the foundation walls on top of the footings that got inspected earlier in the week and poured. Um, they're setting the foundation walls now, uh, and I don't think they'll have them uh, completely set and lined up until later today in hopes to pour concrete walls on Monday. Uh, once we get the concrete walls poured, we work the next seven days very tightly in getting the uh, foundation waterproofed and backfilled, uh, but we don't like putting dirt on the walls until we do have a good seven day strength on the concrete. Uh, we're lucky out here we've got a nice sandy bottom and sandy material to backfill with, so we don't have a heavy clay that puts too much pressure on them, but still uh, a seven day wait is the uh, recommended uh, on concrete concrete strength so um that'll move on next week into walls being poured and the concrete strength and with that waterproofing and and drain tall during that time frame um across the street from that um up the road just a little bit you'll see lot number 20 uh, you can tell by a very large truck parked in front of the house they are insulating the house today so insulation today, insulation inspection, and drywall stock on Monday and Tuesday. We should be uh, ready to start hanging drywall based on uh, the inspections going and passing through the county. So this one will go into drywall next week. Typically that means a, uh, a couple of days, Tuesday, Wednesday, to hang the drywall, clean it up, and start finishing it uh, Thursday, Friday time frame. So by then, this time next week, we should be well into finishing the drywall. Um, um, hopefully uh, as far as a second coat of a three coat process so uh, that one's moving on quite nicely uh, exterior wise um, we, we should be putting siding on this house in the next week uh, and that'll help make sure that everything stays dry on the inside down at the, uh, the house is getting ready to be drywalled so that's moving on very well um, uh, across the street from that uh, you have lot number um, excuse me lot number four uh, lot number four has progressed to the point where um, uh, we've got the paint started in the house. We got a prime coat of paint on. We're waiting for some, uh, and I'm sorry, prime coat of paint as well as the trim work going on with the semi gloss. So, in the upcoming week, we should start to see the progress with the kitchen cabinets being delivered and ceramic tile being installed. So, uh, progress is moving on here. We get the ceramic in installed, the kitchen cabinets get delivered, and we can start getting the house to a, a closer to the uh, final stages um, as far as the exterior of the house as you can see the siding got completed up there's still missing shutters and a few things and uh, we're waiting for the stone to be delivered for the uh, facade on the front in the garage so that's your production update out here today over at um, Clark's Crossing on uh, Friday October the 5th